Students in Santa Barbara have all sorts of different hobbies after school. For some, it's playing a sport. For others, it's learning an instrument. But for Jack Esteban, it's being the owner and an operator of his own barbershop out of his garage. You know, I was 15 when I started cutting hair. I, I just started because I used to get messed up pretty bad. Then I just had the passion to cut hair because I liked it. It was kind of like art. In the beginning, it was just like seeing people at school like with my haircut that I did. And then I was like, ooh, you know. First person I cut was my grandpa. And, and he didn't really mind because, I mean, he's old and he didn't really care about his hair no more. But and then after was uh, my dad. Then the homies at school, actually, and then the real ones, remember, like back in the woodshop class. Yeah, there you go. When I'm cutting hair, I just, I want to make sure my, my client's really comfortable. I don't want him feeling awkward or anything, because that, that's worse than the haircut, honestly. Like, I just, I'd rather have my client feeling comfortable than, than a bad haircut. I started making my studio last year when I started cutting hair. Um, it's little by little, like I just got a couch and I just, I got some LED lights. I got some new clippers actually. I would say that's my biggest struggle right now, just balancing everything out pretty smoothly. And it's good practice for, for when I'm older. I don't know how to keep time management because time is the most important thing. My plan after high school is I'm gonna I'm a study business. Oh, well, you know, because I'm going to get that shop. That shop's going to come soon. And it's only going to be bigger after this because this is just the beginning. The future is looking bright for young Jack Esteban. Don't be afraid to hit him up if you need a cut. Reporting for DP News, I'm Ada Myers.